brain tech here where tech is made simple so it could be just a couple of days before we see the start of the first feature update for windows 11 version 22h2 rolling out and as posted previously that could be as soon as the 20th of this month september and that's just in a week or two's time and it is possible that the feature update could be changing its name from the 22h2 update to the windows 11 2022 update although this date the 20th of september and that name change have never officially been confirmed by microsoft as i have mentioned previously now microsoft did announce though in an in an official announcement near the end of last year 2021 that windows 11 and also by the way windows 10 would only be getting one major update per year now this could be changing as i did post previously about a month ago that according to a new report um, from windows central that was posted and um, it was suggested that um, Microsoft is planning to start releasing new major Windows versions every three years. Now, at this stage, we don't know uh, if that could be version 24H2 or Windows 12. But nonetheless, um, Windows Central um, were, um, did post that report um, that according to their sources, um, there were rumors that Microsoft could plan to release new Windows every three years or a new version of Windows every three years and then plan to release more frequent feature updates for windows several times per year and i will leave a link in the description to that video as it will give you more information now once again microsoft didn't confirm any of this but these more frequent feature updates um, are appearing to be called and referred to as moments or moment updates now references to moment one and moment two updates have been spotted and as mentioned these will be smaller frequent updates um, that will bring new features to the operating system between the major version updates be it every three years or the one major feature update that was announced by microsoft near the end of last year um, for both windows 10 and 11. now currently not too much is actually known about the moment updates because once again microsoft hasn't um, officially announced anything about the moment updates but references have been spotted over on github and that was in a PowerShell issue that was um, opened up on GitHub back in July of this year. And um, this was recently tweeted by Albacore and Zeno, who are two Windows enthusiasts. And um, if we just head over to that tweet, uh, which was dated the 4th of September, so that was yesterday in my region. Um, Albacore says here, um, nice to see a mention of 229 builds. These are dedicated to the development of the second update moment for windows 11 version 22h2 so that's the second moment update first comes the version 22h2 ga that's general availability when it's released to the general public and that could be as mentioned as soon as the 20th of this month then moment one in october so that's those um frequent updates as i mentioned in that previous video moment one in october and then moment two sometime next year and then um, every moment brings a few new features example tabs in file explorer in moment one now um i think he's hit the nail on the head yeah we aren't really expecting to see um tabs for file explorer roll out in the actual feature update rolling out possibly um the 20th of this month that will be released later and there are sources and um, numerous media reports saying that tabs for file explorer will only be made available um after the actual feature update and that could be rolling out in the moment one update now the references spotted as I, I did say were in a powershell issue and this is just a screenshot of that and that moment two update um as it refers to here double two nine builds is yeah double two nine four zero so that could be the moment two build for that moment two update build double two nine four zero which means that um, the moment one update could be build double two eight. And um, it is um, at this stage known that the release build for the feature update this year, um, rolling out possibly the 20th of this month, will be double two six two one. And as I have posted previously, that could be actually build double two six two one point three eight two to be exact. And build 2261 had has already been um, released to RTM. That's released to manufacturing for manufacturers to start getting their hardware and drivers, as an example, um, ready for the feature update. Now, at this stage, um, uh, Microsoft hasn't confirmed any of this once again. 
But there are reports, and as I mentioned, this recent tweet um, with that re reference to that moment to update, so to speak, in GitHub. And as mentioned, this could be Microsoft's new way of adding new features to the operating system outside of the, um, the three-year release cycle, or be it that one major feature update per year. And um, um, as I mentioned, Microsoft hasn't confirmed any of this. And as I always say with Microsoft, only time will tell, but as I get more information, I will post accordingly. But one thing we do know is that the feature update, be it Windows 11 2022 update or version 22H2, rolling out possibly on the 20th, will be build 22621, which is currently being tested in the Insider program, uh, in the beta channel, and also the release preview channel. And as I have posted previously, that could be build 22621.382, which actually gets released later on this month. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.